My name is Anna, and you are listening to the Billionaire Lifestyle Podcast 3430 Edition with your host and my stepdad, Emmett Michaels. Welcome, everybody, to the Billionaire Lifestyle 30 for 30 podcast with your host, Emmett Muckles. You can find it on iTunes. You can find it on Stitcher. You can find it on Google Play. You can find it on EmmettMuckles.com. You can also come to the (laughs) the Billionaire Lifestyle podcast in Facebook. Yes, we have a page. You know, I have so many little things. Or you can follow me on Twitter. That's EMuckles, capital E, M-U-C-K-L-E-S. The E is the only thing that's capital. The rest of it is lowercase. Follow me. Say hi. Retweet. Do whatever you have to do. Do what you like. Do what you feel. Um, Today, we're going to talk about something that is really important nowadays because information is partially true nowadays. And particularly with we have this shaming culture for whatever, this judgmental culture. And part of that reason is, is that we don't literally have physical intimacy. And I don't mean it like sexual physical int- intimacy, but I'm just talking about relationship and where you hang out with people, where you have things that you have in bond that you f- share the same air. That's what I mean by it. physical intimacy, where you sh- share the same air. Now it's like tweeting and texting, uh, Snapchat, instant messages, but we don't sit down and really chop it up like we used to. So in that vein, a lot of emotional content does not get transferred or it gets lost in translation. So here's what you really, really, really must adhere to is don't believe the lies. And it's really difficult because nowadays things that are half truth or blatant lies are promoted as truth or fact. Do your homework. Don't believe the lies. Take everything with a grain of salt, including what I'm saying. And what I mean by that is do your homework, do your due diligence to make sure that what I'm saying is actually true. Sit down and think about it and deep dive within yourself to see if what I'm saying resonates with you and that it feels true. Lies are permeating our existence nowadays. I mean, lies have truths, things that are just fiction. Don't believe them. Don't believe that you're not important. Don't believe that you don't have value. Don't believe the negative things. Mentally stimulate yourself. Just don't buy into the hype. You know, we have so much stuff. This is, and I've said this in a, couple of other podcasts, the fact that, you know, we used to have a limited amount of choice and that limited amount of choice had us in a really nice place. And the reason it was such a nice place, because we could only choose one of maybe four things. Now we get to choose one of 10,000 things that are all very much the same. And it really doesn't make any difference. I mean, your experience of it really doesn't change that much, but there's so much information that most of it is bull. And once you start believing things that are half truths or not true or just not doing your homework, um, particularly when it comes to yourself, it can be damaging. If someone tells you over and over again, I don't like the way you look, Um, you're not attractive to me, I don't, you're disgusting. People could say these things to you. Don't believe that because you're all beautiful. Uh, You know, when when I sit out in public, I love to people watch. I like to just kind of be a voyeur of people buzzing by, like watching a beehive. And the one thing that I realize is humans are powerful. They're beautiful. They're special. And they exhibit this free will that is the most powerful thing or gift we've been given. But what you can't do is let yourself be torn down by the media, by those who don't have your best interests at heart, Those who want to take from you because they don't feel good enough, don't believe that. Just don't. Here's what, you know, I go through this myself and I've been through it. You know what the truth is and still you talk yourself out of it. 
You know what's true in your life. You know when something is not correct, but you've tried to put something else you try to put a spin on it so that you can be a part of it. Maybe it's a relationship. Maybe it's a job. Maybe it's how you're living your life. Don't make excuses for falsehood. Live your life in the truth. And the truth can be hard to live sometimes. It can be tough living in that. But don't live a lie because at the end, you don't get another chance to do it the same way. You have to stay on point, look in the mirror and say, I will live in truth. I will not live in a lie. Thank you so much. This has been Emmett on the Billionaire Lifestyle 30 for 30 podcast. Thank you so much for being a part of the show please spread it to your friends if it's done some good to you and i pray that it is doing all good things to all those who listen and is waiting for those who need some inspiration and some feel to move forward now we're going to get back to the interviews here i have an interview coming up in a couple of days here uh, that i will be putting out and we'll be moving forward next month with Um, back to the interviews so you'll have this archive that you can always listen to you can always pull up and if you have something that if you want to ask a question you can just send me a question at info at and i will get to those asap till next time look in the mirror that person who's looking back at you make sure you feel so much love for them because they're just waiting with arms open and be that complete wonderful free will wheeling individual that you are created to be till next time love you all peace